walking walking so here we have a little video from aqua 72 hello it's me commenting on himself how he's walking on a beautiful beach this beach is called Talisai over there and they have different names but actually it's like one long beach but they have different names but who cares about names it's beautiful but now they are building here everything like here they have new cranes hi they have new cranes and then they are building a new resort and it will be more and more hard to have access to that beach because of course the resorts want to have the only access so they make a lot of money but yeah you can't uh, I think the locals will always find a way because you can't cross out the locals from the beach in my eyes so as long as I'm with the locals I think I can walk here always or will always have a way to walk here also they say the beach nobody owns like for example when you buy a lot on the beach then maybe you own the lot until here or something so basically as long as I walk on the beach no Chinese guy or no Korean can tell me anything and they don't care anyway because I think they are not on the place where they, they just build the resort and get the money I don't think they stay there so probably I can still walk here as long as I want even if there's resorts everywhere but now it's very quiet very peaceful so of course it's a special um, quietness special peace special calmness that I'm enjoying now but then even if this place gets like a second Aluna and it's full of people then you can go to another island or something like that. I think in Philippines you never run out of peaceful places yes 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 you heard it you heard it first you heard it first from from the water itself from aqua 72 now you know nobody's doing this here it's just me joke so my home is like 20 minutes walk from here maybe 30 minutes depending on how fast I'm walking maybe just 15 if I would be really fast uh, and the people that are staying here Mudala they pay a lot of money if you want to stay there it's too much for me if you want to have a long term there, I think you're in the all your money get eaten just from the rent. But then when you walk a little bit, 20 minutes where I stay. Good price, good price. This is Talisai tree. That's why they call it Talisai Beach. I'm feeling like a blogger now. Making video of myself and talking to my camera. That's what you do when you're alone. Well, basically, I could go to like my friends, but they are on the other side. So here I don't really know anybody, just my camera. So my friends, whoever is watching this, let's see. I uploaded this now to probably YouTube. So whoever is watching this, 
always remember to stay humble because that's the key of success humbleness because what can what can bring you down when you're already humble like somebody's pulling you down to the point where you already are I don't know so you should have your fundament and your strength in the humbleness and on the simple life and if you manage that I don't see too much like of course everybody will face health problems and stuff like that but that's not the point that's not in our hands well not too much of course stop smoking stop drinking things like that is also part of that but then beside of that like when it comes to your mindset and to the feeling of life and to how uh, to the quality and you already accepted simple life and humbleness then I think it's it's hard to to fall off from that because probably if you fall you're falling into a probably even better lifestyle so simple lifestyle well better is it if simple lifestyle is the best lifestyle maybe you can't fall into a better lifestyle hmm this is worth a discussion but since I'm alone now it doesn't make really sense to discuss with myself because of course you need other opinions to have a discussion I mean probably there's also people saying you should have the most expensive lifestyle to meet other people that are also rich but the danger is that the other people that you are meeting in with that super rich lifestyle um, is just doing the exactly the same and then you're a group of people having debt and acting like being rich and throwing all the money out having expensive clothes big cars and high expenses but then always run behind the, uh, paying the expenses so hmm, this is just a danger it's not necessarily I mean probably if you have a luxury lifestyle you throw all your money out and buy uh, things that don't give you an income back then maybe you also meet have more connections to rich people and they maybe know more ways how to make money so I'm not saying it is wrong to have a rich lifestyle but in my eyes you should have just the lifestyle that is possible from your passive income so when you have let's say a job and you need actively do a lot for that money then to maintain that lifestyle you always need to run behind your job so I mean the people when I look at the Rick Ross Facebook page story of course he has so much money already he owns his house and he uh, makes more more income passively from his music alone and then he has a lot of businesses of course as well so when he doing that lifestyle I think he can't fall down from that because that's already passive he don't need to do anything so I'm watching his his stories for a couple of weeks or days maybe one week two weeks he's not doing anything like he's chilling out he's making videos from from his products he's showing his products like there's new whiskey or something I mean it's not so smart to promote alcohol because people around you that die from alcohol you will feel responsible so I don't see a big value in that but that's what he's doing like he don't need to do a lot and has all this 
luxury around him without getting poor. But then if you want to copy a lifestyle like that, it, I think it does make sense if you make a depth or something, just to fake it. I'm sure some of the people that made it, they made it first with depth and then um, they really got that intention from a lot of people and money coming in and so on. But that's maybe a few. Nobody will see the story of somebody who didn't made it. You know, a story of somebody who see a luxury lifestyle, wants to have that lifestyle, falls in debt just to act like being rich and then try to scam people or whatever to um, attract people to invest in him or his business or whatever it is. And then it's not working. Who will see that story? Nobody will see it. But of course, that's also happening. Yeah, so probably it's almost the same with me. For example, when I had a lot of Bitcoin 2012 and I was trading, I was doing like either or, either I get become uh, very rich, like multimillionaire, or I lose it. So I made that decision, I said, okay, I don't want to be in the middle always. That was my opinion at that time, now I would make it different. But at that time I was like, okay, either or, either I, I am the person that I was before already, or I am super rich. And I lost. <laughs> so who sees my story now? Not a lot. If I would be rich, probably way more people would see that story. So that's how it is. The winners make the history. Oh, okay. It's so strong. Daddy, excuse me. Why don't I take picture? Picture? I can make a picture from you, yeah. Yeah, from you now. Yeah, ah, yeah, ah, we both uh, together. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. Yes, okay. Yeah, it's okay. Yay! But, but it's too bad, don't you? Ay! Where? Where do we do the picture? On which place? Hello, I did it on the way. Dale, oi. Maula. I'm just like this. Okay. Hey, but now, oi. Another pose. One, two. Smile. Ipa portrait baru gaya, oi. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Ah, uh, no, I don't drink, thank you. Um, <laughs> yeah. uh, wow, look at that. <laughs> Did you see that already? What's Probably that? Yes, huh? You want this? Yeah, want Coconut this? wine. Coconut wine. Yeah, okay, sir. I taste a little bit. You want bit, to yeah. taste it? Yeah. 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 Ah, okay, okay. Yeah, maybe later I come <laughs> here back again. <laughs> yeah. So, making a brand out of coconut wine and then selling it, huh? That's what it screams like. But. No. Who want to who want to make a living out of alcohol? I mean the Germans, let's be honest, a lot of Germans becoming alcoholic. It's not nice to watch. Like maybe when they started 50 years ago or 30 years ago, that maybe wouldn't be a problem. But then now there's like a culture full of alcoholics and I mean not so nice to see so winners make history huh look at this winner whoever built this must be big winner huh Beautiful Bellevue Resort. So.
so that's where I'm walking sometimes not every day today I felt like so sometimes I see uh, celebrations here from uh, police from um, from Bisaya so I think this is like connected also to authorities from Philippines and here I think they don't have a big tax system like everybody that I ask they say no no here you don't need to pay taxes but I think some establishment probably paying some taxes because the celebrations look quite big and then they told me that the police officer was paying for that for the whole people and the whole beach was full they had like music, good food, uh, dancing, like all of that. And yeah, when one person paid for all of that, I think he must be paid good. So there must be also some kind of tax system here in Philippines to make that possible. <laughs> or they are selling the trucks that they stealing from the people. I don't know. Anyway, so this is Bellevue Resort and uh, very peaceful to walk here. This is Family Beach. The family Beach is uh, it's very smart. I think the Filipinos is also kind of smart because they have like this kind of beaches where um, Families can go, locals can go, like everybody. Everybody could, could go there. And I think that won't disappear. Like nobody will build a resort here. So probably, that's my guess. I, I don't know yet, but probably here you, the people and including me could always come and have access to the beach. Yeah. So that's very smart. The Filipino is always the best owner because they, in my feeling, do it for the community. So when they have a lot on the beach, they keep access for everybody. <laughs> 